Okay, so I have a few vintage starter pinstripe baseball jerseys. Now, I don't know if these are quite popular as they used to be back then, but um, I really like them a lot. I think they're really, really dope. So I have a Chicago Bulls um, Raider one and a LA Kings one. And the Bulls one, I have to say, is probably one of my favorites. I mean, the quality of these things are just amazing. To me, the vintage jerseys are just way better. Of course. But um, in case you don't know what to look for in these things, the starter is logo is always going to be on the left sleeve on all of them. The tagging is going to be blue, and I wear an XO. And on the right sleeve, this will have the NBA logo. And I'll show you the different logos. But so it actually says starter on the button. But uh, yeah. So on the Raider one, on the right sleeve, it shows the AFC screen printed it's also it's screen printed by the way and yeah, that one's a size large this one is not mine i sold this one but i do have this exact one in an xl gotta have myself one and uh this one is the la kings one this nhl patch and again it has the starter right there single stitched and i have a t-shirt in here XO, yeah, okay. So, starting with the bulls on the back. Really, really nice stitching right here. This, I just love these things. And this particular one, I got it for such a steal. Now, these ones normally go for like 50 bucks and up. They're really common. A lot of people, well, at least back in the day, that I know have had one of these. But I'm not a bulls fan. I'm a clipper fan. And the only reason why I have this is because, number one, it was such a steal. And I like a lot of former Bulls players like Derrick Rose, one of my all-time favorites. Joe Kim Noah, Ben Gordon, Jamal Crawford, Scottie Pippen's one of definitely my favorites. I do like MJ, but I prefer Scottie. But, um, yeah. Oh, yeah. I picked this up for like 25 bucks from a reseller. So, yeah. Dope. And, of course, you know, I'm a big Raider fan. Gotta have one of these. This, and these are all the spell outs, by the way. These aren't what the ones with the big patch logos on the back. So, yeah. And this is the Kings one. And to me, the Kings ones, the LA Kings ones are kind of rare. Well, not rare, but they are really hard to come across. Especially in a size XL. Because, well, for, for starters, you'll never, you, you'll hardly find these in like really great condition because some of them are always stained, beat, missing buttons, etc. So, yeah. But, uh, that's pretty much it. Again, I really love these jerseys, so I just thought I'd show them off. Nothing too crazy. But, uh, thanks for watching. Peace.